average fourth grader until she accidentally saves a unicorn. The unicorn is so grateful that she offers Phoebe one wish. What does she wish for? Phoebe wishes for the unicorn to become her best friend. So now Marigold Heavenly Nostrils is best friends with Phoebe. They do things like braiding their hair and having sleepovers and having lots of laughs. If you like funny books and graphic novels, then you should check out this book, Phoebe and Her Unicorn by Dana Simpson, available in our library and on Epic. I recommend this book to my classmates and because it talks about Pete the Cat. And his snowy day. And his snowy day. That he didn't go to school. That he didn't go to school. And he stayed home. And he stayed home. Hi, my name's Nyla, and my book is about too much glue. So the characters are a dad and the boy and the mom. The problem is that the family uses glue too much, which they're not supposed to, but they use it almost for everything. So the boy goes to school, and then he gets in trouble because he uses too much glue. And then he was using glue, and then it splattered all on his clothes and body. Then he falls on the table because he was standing on it. And then he got stuck on the table. Everyone is panicking. And then, if you want to know the rest, at the ending, you go check it out the book, Too Much Glue. It can be on Epic. Hello, Cookie. If I was a girl who liked to eat cookies, she wanted one more cookie, but her mom said no. Isa was really angry. She got home, she took a deep breath and read a funny book. Angry with a villa, going to eat it books. Hi, my name is Lily, Tinkerbell's friend. Do you like fun and adventures? Well, me and Tinkerbell had a race. It, it was at Pixie Hollow. It was amazing. To see who won, check out this book. It's called The Great Fairy Race by Red Thanks. Bye. Hey guys, this is my book and the book name is Let's Build a Snowman. The author is Patricia Lagan. And it was too cold and then they went inside because the snow was too cold and then they made a snowman out of paper. And the character is Max and Mo. Thank you. So today I'm going to be showing you the book Fox and Fox. It's by Dr. Seuss. It's about a fox wearing socks. I'm going to read you a little bit of the book. Fox and Socks by Dr. Seuss. Fox, Socks, Box, Knocks. Knocks and Box, Fox and Socks. Knocks on box on fox and socks and box. Bye. Hi, let's meet the tiger who loves to play with his friends. But something sad happened to him. Daniel is the main character. Daniel fell out of group because he he couldn't stay playing with our friends and feels feels sad if he can't this book this book is for all those who like to play with our friends 
and feelings. I feel better. I like this book because I am like Daniel. And when I talk about my feelings, I feel better. The title is Daniel Feels Left Out. The other by Maggie Testa. Hi guys, I've been reading a book called My Pet's Mine. The author of this book is Courtney Shamel and Winnie Corilla. This boy name is Piper. And she she made a pet slime because she's allergic to every pet that's cute. And when her grandma went to work, she was missing because somebody kidnapped her grandma. And this is a very nice book. You should go ahead and check it out on Epic or Amazon. Bye, guys. Hi, I want to talk about a beautiful story. The main characters are Chester and Mrs. Raccoon. The story the story is about that Chester didn't want wanted to go to school because he was afraid and scared. So he wanted to play, he wanted to play with his friends, he wanted to um read and he wanted to stay with his mom. The title of this book is The Kissing Hand by Audrey Penn. Do you like dinosaurs? Have you ever wondered which is the biggest dinosaur and the smallest dinosaurs? Have you wondered what do they eat? What does their skin look like? How do they have babies? If you want to be a dinosaur hunter and learn some more about dinosaurs, then check out this book, Dinosaurs, by Kathleen Widener-Zofield, available in our library and on Epic. <laughs>